Hi everybody, um, just a warning for those who don't like to hear me babble, um, this is a public service announcement from me to all the people who leave kind, loving, and encouraging comments on this channel. I want you to know how much I appreciate those that do that and how much I appreciate those that watch these videos and don't leave a comment um, because you're getting the information that I have been inspired by the Holy Spirit to share and it's not for my sake because um, it's not about me I don't do these videos for my own self-gratification and as a matter of fact most times I don't even want to do them I uh, I work full-time I volunteer two days a week which leaves me only one day a week off and that's today and uh, due to my living arrangements I am constantly under stress and spiritual attack I am physically exhausted most days because my job is physical. When I volunteer, it's physical. And I just have a lot to do physically. <laughs> so um, please forgive me for coming on here and making videos sometimes and sounding really tired. And sometimes I go on and on and, and I babble and I don't get to the point and... Um, I apologize for that, uh, but I am just want everyone to know I am doing the best that I can with trying to share the information that the Holy Spirit guides me to research and to put together and to take notes on and to go look up images and try to put it all together in a coherent way to share. And sometimes I don't do a perfect job but I'm doing the best that I can and I am grateful for those who appreciate the hard work that goes into doing this for some people it might not be that hard um, they might have better equipment than I have I have an old laptop and I'm still using Windows 7 I don't have money to invest in good quality technical equipment and I don't have the time or the energy to spend hours and hours and hours presenting perfect presentations my presentations in the past used to be better and more thorough because I did take more time because I had the time I don't have the time now and I'm under a lot of stress so please forgive me for going on and on um, the Lord made me a very detail oriented person that's how he made me and so when I share a video I like to give you all the details some people don't want details they want the cut and dry I understand that there are lots of other videos on YouTube that people want to watch and they don't have the time to sit and listen to a bunch of details and they want someone to get to the point I get that I understand that because sometimes I'm like that when I'm watching videos because there's there's so much information out there and most people don't have a lot of time to take it all in so um, I just wanted to thank you all that do leave your supportive comments because they mean so much to me you have no idea you guys are my family and without you and your your prayers and your kind comments I wouldn't have continued to do this because I would have just threw in the towel and said forget it I don't want to do this and there are times when I don't want to do it but I know that the Holy Spirit doesn't show me things and other people for us to keep it to ourselves and that's why I, I take on the title as a watchman so um, 
I'm not going to go on and on. Um, I'm just, I'm a little, uh, I got the wind taken out of my sails, so to speak. I was looking forward to sharing some more stuff regarding the calendar, and I was excited about it, but I had to get chores done first, because this is my only full day where I can do a ton of stuff. There are days when I just spend all day doing chores. Tomorrow I'm volunteering. So I can only do so much before I go volunteer. And then once I'm done, I'm done for the day because I'm out in the heat all day long. 110 degree heat all day. Doing physical work and sweating and so anyway, um, but someone left a not so nice comment about the fact that I babble on and go on and on too much and I should just get to the point. And other people have left comments like that in the past. And um, I forgive this person and I am praying that this person will understand that people like me who put things together and put videos out First of all, as a watchman, we have a huge target on our backs, especially when we say certain things. It's not like in the days of old where you could just say whatever you wanted and not have to worry about repercussions, which is why sometimes in my videos I don't specifically verbalize something. I'll show it and point to it. Because we know that the times that we're in now, persecution and censorship is at an all-time high. And so, those of us who do this kind of thing, we're putting our lives, so to speak, on the line. And some, literally. So, um, I don't understand how someone who professes to be in Christ can not see that what myself and other watchmen do is, is a sacrifice for our brothers and sisters. Some people make money off of their YouTube channels. I do not. I don't ask for money. I don't make any money. I'm poor. <laughs> so I do this out of the goodness of my heart. Because I love you guys. And I want you to be aware of what's happening. And a lot of the things that I share, other brothers and sisters see it too. And they share. So I'm not the only one, of course. But... Some things that I have shared in my videos I um, I haven't seen before. Not that it's not out there, because I'm sure that it is. <laughs> but, you know, we're not all subscribed to everybody who puts out things that we want to know. So we miss stuff. So anyway, I'm going on and on. <laughs> so I'm, um, I'm not going to let that bother me anymore. It just kind of, it hurts. When people have no idea what someone is going through in their personal life and then they leave those kind of comments. So, um, just for those who may be listening, just keep that in mind. If you're not someone who leaves comments and you're someone who does get impatient with other video creators in their content, just be patient. And... If you do leave a comment, be loving and kind. Um, there are many times when I've listened to other people's videos and I wholeheartedly disagreed or um, I something they said upset me, but I didn't leave a comment because I didn't need to do that. What good is that? I guess some people think if they criticize and tell me what I'm doing wrong that, that you know, I will change and do it better, which I will, and I, I do try to do the best I can, like I said, but it's not for someone else's job to judge the way I present in my videos, especially due to the circumstances that I'm under. So, if you have to say something, say it in a nice and loving, kind way. That's how we are supposed to communicate with each other. Um... That's all I wanted to say, um, and of course I'm I'm tired now. 
Uh, I did a lot of chores this morning and I'm not even finished yet. Um, I would like to come back on here and share, so it'll be later. And forgive me for those who don't want to know anything personal about me. I'm not like some other channels who just do a media graphic presentation and that's it. Uh, I'm a personable kind of person. I'm that way with people in in person and because I love you all and you're my brothers and sisters I'm going to be that way with you. So if you don't like that kind of um, interaction with someone being real and personable with you then you don't have to watch my videos. But I will still love you and um, that's all I'm going to say. Otherwise I'll go on and on and I'll just keep on babbling. So I love you guys. I'll be back on later to um, share some other things and look at some calendar stuff. Although, um, I don't know if it means anything, but I thought I would share. It means something to me, and so I was just wanting to share it. So, I love you guys, and I will talk to you later. Shalom.